We are out here at Powers Butte Wildlife Area in the Far West Valley, and we've got a group of volunteers from Audubon, Arizona, and Wild at Heart Rehabilitation Center, and we are installing 48 burrowing owl habitat burrows and nest box for future translocations. And these ag fields that we're seeing out here are the traditional habitat that these owls are becoming more and more used to. And it's because our property is protected, it's state owned, we can ensure the at management activities that occur out here and that the owls will be able to hopefully be prolific and not be too disturbed. This little owl used to be very, very common throughout the whole West um, and they've disappeared. Unlike other owls that are uh, active during the night, burrowing owls are active during the day. Uh, they live in groups, so people get to see them interact with each other, um, and folks just fall in love with them. This is actually day three of work that we've done and phased over the last month. So we bring out big excavators and we dig deep into the ground. About four feet down, we put a nest box into the ground, or in this case, it's a Coca-Cola canister. And that's where the owls will actually go and have their nest. They live underground compared to other owl species. So we're installing their nest site and their habitat. Um, we've got folks that are digging. We've got folks that are tying wires together and putting the tubes together. So ultimately, the burrow will be filled in with dirt. You've got your burrow hole out in the open and they'll go into that and tunnel all the way under the ground. So ultimately, uh, this winter in January, we're hoping to be able to come out here and we're going to translocate uh, burrowing owls out here to our property um, at Powers Butte as it's one of our wildlife areas and um, they're going to be permanently protected here.